All right, how's it going everyone? You're watching the Green Dream Project, Jim here. We're back at it today with another video. I don't know what today holds in store. I'm just gonna be doing a bunch of work. I'm gonna take you along with me. Today is going to be hot and I have waited until the temperatures got up there before I start doing some crazy intensive manual labor because that's how I roll. <laughs> what do we have on the agenda for today? Well, there's all those cinder blocks I picked up. I'm gonna be laying those out to put the totes on. First, I think I'm gonna grab some of that gravel way back there. I'm gonna spread it out. That way it can help me level the cinder blocks and then I can put the totes on that and get that all ready to go. I'm excited, a lot of work today, but I'm ready to do it. <sighs> That's not all though. I got some news to report. Oh, this is so sad. How's I was picking up the cinder blocks? This happened. I'm not sure exactly what we're gonna do about it. All the tires on this truck are bad. I think this truck is down for the count for right now. I think getting all four of those tires replaced might cost upwards near like $1,000. So I'm gonna hold off on that right now. The truck's down for the count. Ugh, so sad. But what can you do? These things happen. Hopefully we won't need it anytime soon. Cross your fingers. All right, without further ado, let's get to it. A lot of work to get done. Gravel, cinder blocks, 100 degree heat. Sounds perfect for me. No, I was sore yesterday moving those blocks and today I'm even more sore. Shoulders, chest, all over my back, hurting. But what can you do? Work's gotta get done. Work's gotta get done! Ah! Jessica's over by the garden, she thinks I'm crazy. Jessica's been busting butt too, let me tell you that. Working in the garden, taking care of the daily chores. Man, she has been all over the place. Helping me, and trust me, I need a lot of help. Ah! Yeah, so I'm looking at the ground where the toad's gonna be. And I'm thinking, I like the idea of spreading some gravel around here a little bit better and trying to dig up some dirt and leveling it that way. And it doesn't have to be super level, just a little bit better than it is right now. I think it'll be a nice surface for the cinder blocks to rest on. So I just put a thin layer of gravel down, maybe one to two inches. I don't think I need that much. Just a little bit so that the cinder blocks aren't resting right on the dirt. So I'll have the gravel, cinder blocks, then the tote. Hopefully it's all even. I'm just gonna start with one layer here. Ultimately, I think I'm gonna stack two. I wanna raise these uh, totes up a little bit. That way, when we use the water, we can get a little bit more water pressure being that's up a little higher. Let's say we're trying to fill a water jug or something like that, we'll be able to get that right under there. But starting with one, just lay these out. Dan, just gonna check and see what the, what the level is on these. And I might need to come out. I don't even think I need the middle one. <laughs> All right, now the moment of truth. I'm gonna get Jessica out here. We'll lift this toad up here and we'll see how it looks. Oh, 
All right, the tote's been placed. Looking pretty good. I don't like this though. I'm gonna have to adjust the corners a little bit so that uh, no wobbling. And probably get a little bit more gravel underneath some of the middle blocks. It's not really resting on the middle blocks right now. But other than that, looking pretty good. Well, this took a little finagling, but it looks like it's sitting on there pretty good. I think we got a good base going. Now that that one's done, I gotta get the base going for the other one. Then should be good. Then I can start on the piping. So as you can see, the clouds have rolled in. Woo, I don't know. <laughs> Actually makes for a really good working weather. The temp's high, but now that that sun's blocked, oh, it feels good out here. Are you seeing these clouds right now? I feel like this is a race against time. We might actually get some rain today. Well, it ain't going to the main tanks, I'll tell you that. If we do get a bunch of rain, we might get some out by the Hacienda, but the clouds are rolling in. I tell you, the clouds are actually a godsend today. <laughs> Well, looks like I got this project done just in time. The winds are picking up. We're starting to get a little bit of a drizzle. I'm not sure how much rain's coming that gonna come down, but got it done just in time. It is coming down, it is coming down. -hoo -hoo -hoo. This is exciting. Oh, I wish I had the piping done, it is not done. I think this will work okay. Yeah. I got that other pipe wedged in. But I think I need just something to, if you can find something to wedge in here. Mm. And I think this will be good. I think we can catch a little bit of water. Like what? So the monsoon rains are here. It said no rain in the forecast, but here it goes. That's kind of what I was expecting. So I definitely didn't beat it. But hopefully I don't miss out too much rain. I gotta keep plugging away. All right, thanks a lot for joining us, everyone. I'm gonna try and bring you some more rain footage at a later time. We'll catch you on the next video. Bye. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, I can't go in there. I can't go in there. <laughs>